in some way, cause and effect is a Buddhist word. Karma is definitely a Buddhist word. But in, a, in many ways, actually, cause and effect is it's a universal truth. It just means that if you're eating a lot of, you know, today, I don't know what you guys had for lunch, but if you look at the lunch, you will know whether you're accumulating karma for diabetes, heart attack, fatty liver, whatever. <laughs> That is, you know, that's karma, cause and effect. Right? You know, and then, right now, if you are working very hard, but not very spending a lot of time with your family, that is cause and effect for very successful, but very distant with your children in the future. You know? That's a karma. So similarly, you know, whatever, basically, you know, we call work-life balance, etc. But according to the, you know, even the work-life balance is a cause and condition. Accordingly, there will be a result. Some will be gain in the family time, closeness, some will be lost in the financial benefit. You know, and whether you exercise, everything. So even planting a flower is a cause and effect. Eating food is a flower, cause and effect. Cooking food is also cause and effect. When you talk to somebody and you can see the reaction that you, in others, and how they react to you is a cause and effect. So many times I, you know, I joke also that if you have an argument with husband and wife, you know, Husband argues with the wife in the morning, evening he doesn't get dinner, that's karma. 